We've got Pete here. Uh, we're on the Okura, Long Bay Okura Marine Reserve today and we're gonna check out the state of the estuary, check out uh, one of the streams that's flying into the Hauraki Gulf, see what the sediment's like. Pete, smile for the camera. All right, we've just arrived at Cutapero Bay and we've got a stream that's coming off this big development here. Um, this stream is depositing sediment into the beach and on the tides it gets washed around to the Long Bay Akura Marine Reserve. Pretty shocking stuff, eh? It all ends up heading around this beach at a land day car point into the Okura estuary, uh, which you know can dearly do without the sort of rubbish coming its way, eh? Very pristine spot normally, crystal clear water and now it's all covered in mud again. I mean, just look at the state of it. Now, it wasn't that long ago, this water was flowing crystal clear. Fresh water entering the ocean. Now you can just see the tinge of orange, set the fine sediments that are lying in it. And uh, yeah, all being washed out to sea. Just made it to the intertidal part of the stream and you can see the color of it, or I hope you can. It's just a disgusting orange clay sediment color. The stream used to run clear, inanga, you know, freshwater fish, white bait eels, mullet and uh, flounder, all sorts of creatures use this waterway. Um, you can see down here that uh, just a layer of, thick layer of mud is covering what was a sandy bottom. Um, this is totally unnatural. It's enough to smother and kill any sort of life forms trying to, trying to live down at this sand level. It's enough to make anyone sick. Um, you know, we just let these big fat cat developers get away with murder, really. Just because they want to put in a couple of hundred houses on these cliffs doesn't mean we should be totally destroying, uh, you know, the receding place of natural wonder. Another row's brewing over sediment pollution in a marine reserve in Auckland's Hauraki Gulf. They're right to be worried about that, and I am too, and have a huge amount of sympathy for that. We are not, on any basis, adding to the sediment discharges in that estuary at all. You see here the division between a really dirty stream running out and a already dirtied stream running into the, the marine reserve. Here's a bit of a contrast shot. You can see just the state of it, colour up in the hills there paving the way for their uh, silly mansions. You can paint. Oh, it's just, you know, you know, two years of this is just ridiculous that we're still getting these sediment loads coming down and settling on the sand here. You can see it's like walking on ice at the moment, this layer of mud that's coated everything. And a lot of this will just get washed off next time it rains or the strong tides moving in and out will just wash it back out into the Okura Marine Reserve and it's gonna end up in the Haraki Gulf. And, you know, it's hidden in the Haraki Gulf it just disappears, but it's like, no, it's not. It's settling on the bottom and causing all sorts of mayhem out there. Exactly, we don't so, want this. That looks like diarrhea, mate. <laughs> it's just carotid, eh? It's filth.